Fifty Shades of Grey, the one movie that makes men wish they didn't have a girlfriend. Hey, what's up? Hey, what's up? A lone man has been caught on camera leaving the movie Fifty Shades of Grey. And in my opinion, that's not that big a deal. But the way this guy reacts when he realizes he's been caught on camera is just priceless. Here's the clip here. Now you'll notice him in the top right coming out and the second he realizes that woman's being interviewed on camera, he gets extremely awkward. He notices and he's like, oh, I, uh, ooh, maybe I, uh, maybe I forgot my popcorn in the mood. No, I can't go back in there. I guess I'll, I'll just stand here awkwardly. Oh, uh, can I pretend you're my girlfriend? No? Okay, yo. Uh... <laughs> this guy has no reason to be embarrassed, okay? Just go watch Fifty Shades of Grey if you want to watch it. It's just a movie. Who cares? Well, it was a book, then it was a movie. Well, it's practically a porno, but still, just a movie. Who gives a shit if you're a man going there by yourself? Who cares? Honestly, if he just walked by the camera and acted like nothing was happening... <laughs> Nobody would be watching this right now. Nobody would care. You know, it could have been worse. He could have came out zipping his pants up. Then everyone would have been saying some other stuff about him. Maybe that's why he turned around real quick. Maybe he was just tucking his boner up so he could walk past the camera. But honestly, if he just walked by the camera all normal, no one would have noticed him. But he stood there for so long, being so awkward. And the way he acted makes me think he must have been, like, up to something. He probably went there to pick up single women. You sly dog, you. Or maybe he was just in the back masturbating. He could have also got out of the situation just by walking really close to one of those women that was walking out with him. People would have just been like, oh, he must have been with them. And then when he gets past the camera, he'll be like, see you later! And then those women will be like, who was that creepy guy that was sniffing my hair? But if he really, really wanted to get out of it and cover up the fact that he went to Fifty Shades of Grey by himself, he should have just come out of the movie theater and been like, son of a bitch, I thought this was the Spongebob Squarepants movie. I am severely disappointed. This whole time I thought Spongebob and Patrick were in some sort of erotic relationship. It wasn't until they started spanking each other until I was like, something's not right here.